Hey guys, Rustin here. So I hope you guys enjoyed the little uh, mini video I did with the uh, set 2.5. Uh, now we're on to the actual set that came out, Assault into the Demonic World. This is uh, set number three for Saga Cluster. I'm looking forward to uh, cracking into this uh, little pre-release kit. Uh, so, without further ado. And there we have it. So, keeping the tradition going, let's crack open a Dr. Pepper. Hope you guys are having a good day today. This is nighttime for me. That is when I am most active. Yeah. Ah. Yeah. Mm. Ah, that is some good shit. So here is the game plan for this pre-release kit. You guys have already seen me open a full pre-release kit with all the boosters. I am going to try and just get the ruler packs. And if I get a god pack, that's awesome. But uh. I'm mostly going to aim for uh, packs to draft with in the future. So, wish me luck. There is 72 boosters here. Oh, and hey, look at that there. Yeah, look at this. The new play mats for the set. Let's uh, go ahead and get one of these open. Pretty excited to uh, get these packs cracked and see which rulers I hit for the first, uh, first ones. Uh, well, uh, this is a little... Uh, a little too far. Yeah, okay, you, you guys will you guys will see this here in a sec. I'm gonna get the uh, boosters out and all that good stuff. Alright, let's uh, let's take a look at the promos. Alright, so uh, we got our basic rulers, the Giant of Will. Actually uh, working on making some custom uh, basic rulers. It still like all the same stats, it's just we're gonna have like different artwork and stuff. It's a little more uh, appealing than no no offense to the guy who did the artwork for that, but like, you know. So we got uh, Atomic Turbulence as our pre-release promo. Beautiful artwork of Violet with all the different atoms circling around her. That's a very cool card. And then uh, for our buy box promos, we have, what is this, uh, Pulsing Thunder. Some really cool uh, artwork there. E. Noise. Hey guys, so still getting everything organized. Uh, by organized, I mean I'm just gonna like lay it out uh, here in a second. But I uh, just want to show off this uh, playmat. Really beautiful playmat. We got Fari in the middle. We got our boy Brad over here. We got Olivia. We got the new version of Wolfgang. And then uh, probably everyone's like, like lore favorite, Violet, just because of the ties to Machina and Mariabella. Um, yeah. So uh, let me. Uh, Jump cut. Alright guys, we are officially back. Not to uh, cover up Wolfgang here in the corner, but I mean like, it's more organized this way and you know, Fari's got her head covered, but yeah, whatever. Uh, so, like I said, the goal here is to get boosters for draft out of this uh, pre-release kit, just so way I'll have more packs to draft in the future. So, let's try to uh, hunt for some rulers. Uh. Alright, first pack of the new set. So, I would say top of my list is Violet. Yeah, I would say Violet's at the top of my list. Uh, I kind of, I'd say Wolfgang's up there too. I'd say Violet, Wolfgang, Brad, and then like Olivia and Fari are kind of tied. I mean like, I didn't even check the back, whoops. My, my, my mind is elsewhere. Let me uh, go to the card view. You guys can see these cards. Yeah, there you go. Alright, so first card of the new set is Swamp of Sorrows. This is a Wolfgang card. It's one of the demonic world cards. Uh, yeah. I might run Wolfgang uh, this, uh, th this uh, coming up GP. I don't know. There's a lot of good cards uh, out right now. We got Heart of the Avenger for the Asmodeus stuff. Improved Healing Robot, which I see this and then like, I, there's more, more machine stuff and I'm like, what if I ran like Machina? Wait, wouldn't that be a curveball? Uh, then we got Forest Darkness, Demonic World. Hero of Courage. Oh, the new uh, Schrodinger artwork. Fucking adorable. Noise. 
Then uh, we got this artwork for the Magic Stones bag, which it's actually, it's, it's up there. It's not my favorite artwork for Magic Stones, but it's definitely really nice. Life point. Uh, we got mis the, yeah, the Mysteries of Zero. Beautiful artwork. There's Brad with the chiseled jawline. Then uh, for our foil, we got a rare here, a fish drive. Very cool Olivia support card. What was this? This was, uh, that was a rare. Alright. I'm gonna go uh, faster on these. I just wanted to kind of milk the first pack. I'll uh, kind of just thumb through uh, the normals and get to the good stuff. Oh, well, okay, well. <laughs> Oh wait, this magic stone's a normal? What? Magic stone of atoms. Did they... Did they make the magic stones normals? That's really fucking awesome if they did. Holy shit. Uh, let's see now. Ooh, oil pond. Nice. Uh, yeah, so the, here's the water magic stone for the set. Once again, good, good artwork, but, you know, it's not like my top, but uh, still cool. A Atomic Bahamut. One of the cards that makes me want to run Violet. And then lastly, we got Hero of Water. Noise. So, yeah, uh, Brad's all about uh, seal mechanics. So, based on the number of magic, magic stones you have, and then also he has ways to like increase the seal count. Uh, then Olivia is all about randomness, but actually controlling the randomness. Fari is all about heroes, which kind of makes me think about like Yu-Gi-Oh in a way, because heroes are like an archetype in a way you know, going on there. Then we got Demonic World, which Demonic World also feels like an archetype. And then you know we got Olivia, uh, not Olivia, we got Violet with uh, Adams, which also almost <laughs> feels like an archetype. Which I don't have any complaints about. Like, like Adams are fucking cool. I kind of, I kind of, like, I want to build a deck with all these. That's what it comes down to again. I, I have a, I have a, I love my game too much problem where I, I want to make a deck with all of them. Well, I want to make a deck for all of them. Uh, so we got Dark Prominence as our super rare atom. And then we got, oh, okay. That is fucking gorgeous. Holy shit. And yeah, no, uh, normal again. So yeah, I... I, I must have, like, glossed over the fact that the magic stones for the set are normal. That is, that is cool. God damn, that is nice. But yeah, the fact that the magic stones are uh, normal in this means that they'll be easier to get in drafts. Huh. Awesome. Yeah, look at that. You got the stone of the... Magic Stone of the Kingdom, which is uh, for this is for Demonic Worlds. Yep, yep, that's cool. Oh, look at another stone, Magic Stone Knowledge, which yep uses the seal mechanic. We got Light Stone. We got a token here. We got Charlotte's Light Transformation Magic. That's cool. And then for our foil, we have Glowing Tree of Valhalla. So yeah, good to see uh, more Violet, uh, not Violet, more uh, Charlotte magic cards. That's, that's pretty awesome. Well, transforming magic. It's humid in my room, not gonna lie. Alright, let's see what we got. Ooh, that is beautiful. Paradise of Fallen Angels. I almost said Ashes. Uh, oh wow, look at that. Some beautiful artwork. So, yeah. yeah, this was one of the Darkness Stones that I'm not like super gung ho on the art for, but uh, yeah. Beautiful violet art. We got uh, another dark prominence. Then we have, hey, look, oh, it's so cute. Improved healing robot. That's beautiful. 
No major hits yet, but I mean, we, we still got a shit ton of packs to open. And I, I would like to say the big hits for uh, for drafts, but yeah, what can we do? Alright. Ages. Uh, just go ahead and skip over. Oh, this one had some funny text. Uh, let's see what the focus is. My body? No, it won't taste good. Brad, the immortal stage. Oh. He's starving. You gotta feed your puppers. Uh, fire magic of stone. E. A. Well, I mean, like, to be fair, I already had a will coin for Brad prepared, but I mean, like, I'll still take it, you know. Sam, so, yeah, for our rare slot, we have a blood lord. And then we have, oh, nice. Oh, that is awesome with full art. Holy shit, that is. Yeah, Residence of the demonic world. Beautiful. Still no ruler yet. Uh, let's see. Got Wolfgang token. Hey, we got Charlotte for the super rare. Noise. Then we got Hero of Compassion. Or full art. Uh, let's see. Oh, oh shit! Hey, we got bread. Noise, 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 noise. All right. Let's uh, take a quick look through the pack. Uh, then for our rare slot, we got uh, glowing tree of Valhalla. So guys, if you'll give me a second, I'm gonna sleep up our boy here. But, uh, let's, uh, let's get a nice uh, view of him, yeah. Look at that artwork, that... Bra bravo, bravo, bravo to, to everyone that does art for Force of Will, like, making the game look so nice. Yeah. Alright, so quick pause, I'm gonna sleep him up real quick. Alright guys, we are back, and our boy Brad is nice and sleeved up. Uh, so... I know Brad isn't like top of my list, um, but like in my heart, in my heart, Brad is Brad is up there. He he's a, he's an awesome card, and I I just hope he he does better than everyone is thinking he's going to do. He he has ties to the six sages, so that's part of the reason why he's up there in my heart. Also, his name is Brad. How how great is that? I I'm still in the mindset of like. Whoever was, like, naming him, like, was holding back so much to just call him Chad. Oh my god, this booster pack. I could use Brad's help. Alright, let's see what we got. Ah, no ruler. Which... Yeah. Hey, look at that. We got Olivia's Magic Stone. Which... It got, it got the community so, like, up and at him of, like, the rule process about this. That was really funny. That's that's a whole that's a whole story, but yeah. If you know, you know. Magic stone. We got a fishy. Oh, oh that's oh sweet, the thunderfish. Okay, cool. At least I think that's thunderfish. Ah, oh, I'm drawing a blank on that. Uh, so we got brave force for our rare, and then we have a starving beast. Nom 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 on Brad. That's cool though. Whoosh. Uh, let's see. Oh, that's an awesome art. Yeah. Okay. Got a magic stone and some art of Olivia. Hey, we got Witch with a Pointy Hat. Great naming. Great naming. Hey, this is a Marvel rare, so that's awesome. I love that there's like like fan lore about which character this actually is it, it could just be like a random character but it could it could have like be, be like an actual like mainline character with a name but yeah then we have number seven anti-magic for our, our normal full art very lovely all right this is a uh, different uh, last pre-release i think i got like the god pack within the first stack and we got one more booster left so i don't think that's gonna happen Okay, we got a special magic stone. Oosh, another special magic stone. Man, they're giving them out like hotcakes, holy shit. Alright, 
We got our basic stone. We got a token will coin for Olivia. We got absorbing knowledge for our rare. Hey, <laughs> awesome. And we have a full art absorbing knowledge. Man, with all this, wait, we're getting a lot of Brad support here. Maybe maybe this pre-release set, pre-release kit is saying like, hey, run Brad. All right, let's see if we, I, I feel a ruler here. I feel a ruler. Nope. Ah, balls. Uh, some cool cards. Our basic magic stone. Another uh, artwork of friend. Oh, oh, we got tiny violet. Oh, that's so adorable for our super rare slot. But yeah, look at that. Oh, it's so fucking cute. <laughs> Uh, and then uh, we have a full art atomic reactor for our normal slot. Well, normal full art, I mean. Not normal slot. Alright. Come on. Ruler. No. Ah. See, Brad, Brad took me off guard. Like, uh, caught me off guard. I was not expecting it. Okay, so love all the art. I'm not the biggest fan of this one. It, it's doing like a... I don't know if it's like going for like actual watercolor or like... Like, I guess if they're going for like a grime or something, but like it's Hero of the Sacred Spirit and like his face is just like, it doesn't really show up as well on camera, but I mean like it looks cool, it's just that it's, it feels out of place for all the other artwork in the set. Well, actually, does this, no, okay, no, it's, yeah, no, it still feels out of place, yeah. Got another special stone for Brad. Yep, basic and stone uh, for our rare slot. We have Fallen Angel of Hatred. It's cool. And then for our foil, we have a super rare Spark of Life. Nice. Alright, we are in stack number two. We got our first ruler already, so we're in, we're in good shape. Let's try to average a uh, ruler per stack. That'd be awesome. Probably not gonna happen, but I mean, like, a man can dream. Oh, another uh, special magic stuff? No, no, that's, that's, that's actually a spell. Um, yeah, basic, hey, look at that. We got Violet's Art, little will coin, noise, noise. Then we have the Thunder Empress Strike for our super rare, and then for our full art, we have, ooh, nice, some, some Violet artwork, Atomic Fusion. Just normal, but still beautiful. Ah, come on. Whoosh. Oh, and then here's the non non full art version. Uh, let's see. Basic. Oh, it's so cute. I don't know if I'll use this one to make a proxy. It's just it's just too fucking cute. Okay, for our rare slot, uh, we have, what is that, Dark Lord? Look at that guy, holy shit. Looks like an anime protagonist that has like a, oh no, look at he's holding like a little flower, that's cute. Then for our full art, we have a rare, is Lightning Passion. Very cool, very cool. Whoosh, come on, there you go. Nice. Giant of Sacred Spirit. This is a 2000 2000 with barrier. That is pretty awesome. Probably won't see play. <laughs> I'll, yeah, I'd probably run them. Probably would never get the chance to actually cast them, but you know. Okay, we got a token. Okay, we got Shining Heart Scorching Hero for our rare slot. Then for our foil, we have Fallen Angel of the Paradise for a normal. Alright. Okay, we got our basic stone. My point. Hey, nice, we got another Charlotte for a rare slot. Oh, Charlotte's the transforming magic, I mean. And then... We have Improved Burning Robot for a rare foil, that is awesome. And... Ruler, no. Nope. 
I will say I will kind of miss not saying and no matchsticks. That is something I will be missing. Alright, we got fish token. Hey, look at that. Terra Thunderfish. Fucking beefy, beefy, beefy. Beautiful. And then we have Excalibur Reincarnation for our normal full art. Oh, this one, this one feels a little thicker. Do we have a god pack here? Do, do we have, is, is this a god pack? Well, it's definitely not a ruler. Oh, this feels thick. This feels thick. Ah, darn. That was hopeful. I think my fingers are just, uh, like, wanting something more. Oh, sweet. We got, uh, Witch of Melting Eyes for a rare. So, we're starting to get all the... All the oh, look at that. We got a fucking Marvel rare. Full art. Schrodinger White Cat. Is it weird that Schrodinger might be, like, the main reason I kind of want to run Fario? I probably won't run Fario, but, like... Just to, just to get a little, uh, little Dark Alice in there. Mm. Oh, th this feels like a ruler. Ah. Tell you, one of these days they're gonna put the ruler, like, on this slot right here, and I will... Mm. I feel like they should do that. Like, like for those, like, well, no, you'd probably have to... Probably, like, fuck up the... Maybe put the rare slot in the back and then the foil, like one down I don't know I'm not I'm not a pack organizer yeah it's probably just easier that way as far as like how cards get cut and stacked okay, we got the Faria wheel coin very nice a <sighs> Avenger of Asmo of oh wait Amadeus, not Asmodeus, Amadeus. Wow, I've been saying Asmodeus. I am so sorry. Sorry. Avenger of Amadeus. This boy. That's not a typo. That is... That is 10,000. Not 8,000. 10,000, 10,000. When this card is put into a graveyard from anywhere, put on the bottom of its owner's deck. More importantly, it has Pierce and Eternal. Yeah, this this thing is a fucking like win con. Oof. Then we have a hero of darkness for our pull art. All right, we're getting closer. We got four more packs on this slot. Let's see if we can hit a ruler. Ah, uh, nope. Okay, we got our basic. We got another fish token. Wait, is that different art for fish? Hey, that's... Wait. Hold up. Are they different? Oh, they're different Different stat lines, that's why. Alright, we got Scorching Mountain Trail for our rare slot. And then we have... Ooh, look at that. For super rare, we have Lenith, Heroic Goddess of Guidance. Nice. Beautiful. Let's let's actually linger on that a bit more. That is some great artwork. Oh, glimmers with the light, really nice. Ah, oh, that is really cool. Come on, ruler. Let's, I'm feeling Faria. This feels like it could be Faria. It's not Faria. Watch me like a bunch of wolf game cards. No, there's a there's a Faria card. Basic Charlotte. Okay, we got improved burning robot for our rare slot, and then we have another rare slot. We have Guardian Dragon of the Kingdom. That is that is some cool artwork. This is like some artwork they have to like stare at for a bit to really appreciate it. All right, two more packs on this uh, little uh, slot, I mean, yeah, column. Column was the word I was looking for. Okay, starting with a special stone. 
Push, push, push. Fish token, we got fish drive for our rare slot, and then we have, oh, we have a super rare full art. We have Amadeus Fallen Kingdom. Can't believe I kept saying Asmodeus. Oh well. Alright, last pack for this column. Alright. Come on, Violet. Come on, Violet. Ah, oh, no, that's not a ruler. Ah, rip. Two of the special stones, that's cool. Oh, another special stone. Hey, what up? Oosh. Basic. Token. Hey, nice, we got another Charlotte. Transformation, magic, that's cool. Then for our full art we have, oh nice, ah, man, dark prominence for our super rare full art, that is beautiful. Alright guys, we got four more columns, so that is 48 booster packs. Let's see if we can get some more packs for draft, uh, then zero, we're at zero right now, but I don't know I said more packs for draft, we, we have not had any. Any luck yet with uh, the second ruler? So that's not looking great. Uh, there's no real easy way to try, like, even attempt to map out where the rulers ended up. So we got uh, Blood Lord for our rare slot, and then for our full art, we have another rare. We have Scorching Mountain Trail. Nice. I guess in that sense, I could try, like, just like reach in and like just try to grab the ruler pack because I mean like yeah I, I could I could try that just try a random booster it's worth a shot so we got atomic turbulence uh, which is also uh, the uh, the promo uh, for the uh, pre-release kit it's cool you can kind of see the side by side uh, we got the uh, Mysteries of Gruce Ballesta for a normal foil. Alright. <sighs> Go for this one. This one. This one feels like a ruler. Wait, wait, wait. <sighs> yeah, ruler. This one's a ruler. This one's definitely a ruler. It's not a ruler. Okay. I lied. Worth a shot. Would have been cool. Rustin can't snipe rulers anymore. My power's been weakened. Uh, let's see. So for a rare slot, we have Absorbing Knowledge. And then for... Oh! Oh, shit. We got Terminus. Marvel rare for Wolfgang. This guy is... This is another win con. So yeah, rest uh, three recovered demonic worlds you control. This card gains uh, whenever this card deals battle damage to your opponent, you win the game. Right. So yeah, a win con right there. Some good shit. Oh, hey! <laughs> Speaking of Wolfgang... Alright, be very gentle. I'm actually gonna set Wolfgang down. See what else is in the pack. Uh, boo, 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 boo. Boosh, boosh. For our rare, we have Lightning Passion. That's cool. Wow, the tokens and stone pile is getting so big, big just because of those normal special stones. Okay, take a look at Wolfgang. Very cool. Wolfgang, Guide of the Demonic World. Let's back that up a little bit. There we go, that's a good focus. It's a little bit of, uh, like, some scraping going on. Very cool, though. Very cool. Alright, let's uh, sleep him up. So, yeah, two, uh, two rulers so far. Uh, we got our boy Brad, the Immortal Sage, and we got Wolfgang, Guide of the Demonic World. We're, uh, you know, we're, we're, we're like, almost halfway through. You know, I'm gonna, ah, uh, I'm gonna slide these over. 
I will occasionally. Mm. Now, how am I supposed to? No, no, no. I was gonna say I was gonna like bank on there not being a roller in here, but it's so pre-release kits are so random. Like, I'm not gonna be able to. Uh, I try to treat them all like booster boxes. Uh, so we got a special stone. Did that very awkwardly. Basic token. We got the Mysteries of Zero for our rare. And we have Witch of Melting Eyes for our full art rare. Uh, I'm gonna hate that I'm gonna go through the, the rest of this column and there's not going to be another ruler. I feel like that's what, what's gonna happen. Yep. Okay, we got our basic stone token. We got Glowing Tree of Valhalla for a rare slot, and then we have the Mysteries of Mujar for our normal full art. There you go. Basic token. We got Guardian Dragon of the Kingdom for our rare slot, and then we have a hey, nice another rare for, for uh, Violet Brave Force. So I'm gonna make a bet that I feel like Faria and Olivia are gonna be the last two rulers. I feel like that's what's gonna happen. Special magic stone. Basic token. We got Brave Force for our rare slot, and then for our full art, we have uh, another rare. We have Dark Lord for full art. Come on, ruler. Ah. Oh. Little spec. Man, this uh, pile of normals is getting high, but I don't have any cards for the set yet, so not, not, not concerning. So we got Pulsing Thunder for our super rare, and then we have, ooh, look at that. I know it's a normal, but that's some beautiful art. We have Temple of the Dead. Or is it Temple of Dead? Temple of the, Temple of the Dead. Okay, I didn't misread that. Like Asmodeus, Amadeus, 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 Amadeus. All right, let's see a Marvel rare. Let's see a Marvel rare. Oh, yeah, special stone. All right, boosh, boosh. Ooh, we got a super rare. We have Excalibur Revolution, which uh, happens to be the pack art for uh, Faria there, so that's cool. Then we have, oh, just normal. We have the Paradise of Fallen Angels for full art. Woof. Alright, two packs left for this column. <laughs> Basic Olivia token. We have Dolly Olivia's Electric Dolphin for our Marvel Rare. This is awesome. This card I, I could easily see play like outside of uh, Olivia because it says if you would choose or target randomly, you may choose a target, yeah, non-randomly. So that applies for uh, that applies for uh, strangers because you choose a card from your stranger deck randomly. So that's awesome. Someone correct me if I'm wrong there. I'm pretty sure that's how that works. <laughs> Uh, then we have a uh, normal full art. We have Hero of Might. Nice. Ah, oh, come on. There you go. Ah, no ruler for this. Ah, oh, I should have passed on all those packs. Damn it. Uh, nope, nope. We have Fallen Angel of Hatred for a rare slot, and then for the full art we have, oh, super rare, nice, nice, number 13, anti-magic. Cool, cool, cool. Ooh. 
last of uh, 36 packs. Come on. Let's uh try to hit those rulers. Oh, you know what? I, I have some I have an idea. I have an idea. The payoff is probably not going to work, but I have an idea. Alright, so we have a super rare, we have Necronomicon Barrier. Got some cool Wolfgang art there. And for our full art we have a sparkle fish a normal card. Alright, so I open that. Skip it back. Open this one. Ooh, this one feels thick. It's a thick boy. Ah, uh, oh. Had a uh, had some camera juddering there for a second. Got our basic. Got our will coin for Wolfgang. That's cool. For our rare slot, we have Brave Force. Then, oh, nice. Charlotte's Light Transformation Magic as a full art rare. That's awesome. Alright, so open the pack. Skip a pack. See if this uh, strategy plays out. But, oh, shit, it paid off a little. Uh, so, yeah, uh, this is uh, Faria. So, I was kind of right. Yeah, no, I, I was like, I bet, I bet one was going to be Faria. Alright. Noise. So let's uh, set Faria down. Uh, see who else is in pack. Alright, so for our rare slot, we have the Witch of Melting Ice. That's cool. Look at that. Well, okay, let's uh, show Excalibur Genesis. Very cool. We have Faria, Swordmaster of. Was that creation? Yeah. <laughs> Can't read on camera sometimes. But man, that is beautiful. Alright, excuse me guys while I sleep this up real quick. Alright, and we are back. So, yeah, we got uh, our third ruler for the pre release kit. My money is still saying uh, Olivia is gonna be the last ruler because I'd like it to be Violet, but I just. I don't I don't see that happening given the last pre release. I was wanting to uh, have the last one be Feast Sink and it was Wolfgang. So, yeah. Yeah, very nice, very nice. Alright. So, uh. Risky strategy. Gonna treat it like a booster box. So. All that going right there. I will be doing the right sides equivalent of the middle. Let's uh, see if this uh, strategy pays off, Cotton. I, if this was like another ruler, I would have like flipped my shit. That's so many boosters for drafts. <laughs> it would have been so cool. Alright, we got our special stone. We got our basic. Yeah, life point. Hey, nice. We got a Lenif for a rare slot, super rare. Then we have uh, just a normal full art, a Heart of the Avenger. Nice. Oh yeah, yeah. Actually, I haven't read this in since it first like spoiled. Enter, you gain a thousand life. Draw a card. Not bad. Not bad. Just a nice little, uh, nice little cycle. They have like some extra wheel to burn or something. Ah, oh, come on. Ugh. If they had like quick cast or something, it'd probably be nicer. Okay, this booster does not want to open. Little bitch. Okay. Alright. If this is the ruler. Nope. Ugh. Just wanted to be difficult. Goddamn. Special basic stone. Will coin for Olivia. We got absorbing knowledge as our rare slot. And then we have for our super rare pulsing thunder for full art. Very cool. Alright, skip it back. Okay, so that's a new pile. Next booster. Come on, Violet. Nah, nothing. Oh, this was, uh, was, was it this one? Yeah. Yeah. 
So, it's a sparkle fish, but it's a beast. Yeah. <laughs> Thought that was weird. Thought that was pretty weird. That's not a fish, it's a beast, but it says sparkle fish. Yeah. Basic. Aquarium. Oh. Uh, we got uh, improved burning robot. And then we have a blood lord for our rare full art slot. Very cool. Alright, so open the pack, skip the pack. Oh, just now notice he's still here. Come on. Come on, Violet. Nope. Got a special stone for Olivia. Oh, look at that. The violet little coin. Come on. We got our Dark Lord for the rare slot, and then for the full art. Oh! We got Amadeus, our super rare full art. Look how cool that is. You can actually like see the mountains, yeah. Okay, so, oh shit. <laughs> All right, that stack's getting a little high now. Uh, let's uh, let's drop that right there and move these over. Okay, so skip a pack. Next pack. Ah, uh, nope. Okay, we got a special stone. Basic token. We have uh, number 13, anti-magic for our rare slot, and then we have firestorm for our normal full art. Very beautiful artwork of Violet. Alright, skip a pack. Next pack. Oosh, oosh. Basic stone token. We have another witch of melting ice. Is that a playset of them? That's at least three. That's at least three of these. Then we have the Thunder Empress's Strike for our super rare full art. Alright, so skip a pack. I fucked up somewhere. I yeah, whoops. <laughs> I, I, I must have like skipped two packs by accident. Alright, so special stone, another witch, another uh, special stone, basic stone, and oops, <laughs> totally skipped that. Uh, so for our rare we have glowing tree of Valhalla, and then we have another terra thunderfish for our super rare full art, so that's another Olivia support card. Uh, I think it might have been like this one that might have like skipped by accident. So let's uh, let's go ahead and open this one. If this is a ruler and just snipe. That's that's borderline snipe. Nope. Ah, another pack wasted. Damn. The pile grows. Special stone. Basic stone and toke. all oh, another one of those cute. So we got another shining heart scorching hero for our rare slot, and then hey, look at that, <laughs> nice. Oh, it zoomed in really nicely there. Well, I zoomed in, but like, focus, that's like peak focus right there. Oh, how have I not found this angle yet? <laughs> oh, well, that was a great view of that card. All right, so. Scooting over the pile of boosters. All right. The right side. Right side. Don't fail me. We got we got a lot of boosters here. We can save for draft later. Wait, this one's feel, this one feels puffy. Just on the off chance. Just on the off chance. Ah, that would have been cool. Oh well. Another pack down. Rip. Alright, so we got a basic stone token. Uh, for the rare slot, we have Scorching Mountain Trail. And then for the full art, we have 
the mysteries of zero for a rare full art very nice <sighs> all right so let's get the right pack going fill in a fill in a roller let's I, let's actually try to snipe this one yeah yeah i know i'm feeling ruler vibes here let's go for this one right here this one gonna have a ruler pack come on violet come on violet Uh, come on. Ah, nope. Ah, darn. Darn, darn, darn. More packs lost. Can't draft them. Can't do sealed games with them. Uh, so we got Dark Lord for our rare slot. And then we have Atomic Turbulence for our super rare full art. Very nice. Very nice. Okay, so skip a pack, I guess. I kind of just went in there, but I'll skip a pack. Come on. Ah, nope. Special still. Special still. Basic token. We got Lightning Passion as our rare. And then for full art, we have a Glowing Tree of Valhalla, another rare. Very nice, very nice. I gotta skip a panic. Ah, nope. Basic. And for the rare slot, we have a super rare. We have a number 13 anti-magic. And for the full art, we have a normal magical... Is that loveliness? A yeah, magical loveliness. Very nice. Beautiful. Oh, that's right, yeah. Yeah, turn it sideways. Uh, let's not skip it back. Let's do this one. Oh! Very, very gently. Oh. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Easy. Alright, look away from the camera view, Rustin. Look at it with your eyes. Yeah, what up? All right, this is this is a great pre-release kit. <laughs> we got Violet Atomic Automaton for our last roller for the pre-release kit. What up? Oh, oh my God! I'm so happy I didn't skip a pack there. If I had skipped a pack, that would have been that would have been so many more packs that would have been out, like opened. Okay, so I'll be right back, guys. Gonna do a quick sleeve. Alright guys, we are back. We have Violet Atomic Automaton. That's just dust, yeah. Yeah. Alright. Beautiful. Just beautiful. That is an awesome hit to land on, to end on. Uh, I don't know if this pre-release has a uh, ruler pack. Would be cool. Oh, not ruler pack. A uh, gone pack. Would be cool. But uh, we'll save that for uh, for a draft possibility, I guess. Yeah. Alright, so last pack has special stone. We got basic token, and then we have fallen angel of hatred for a rare slot, and you guys uh already saw we hit a ruler. Violet hell fucking yeah. Fuck yes, okay. No offense to Olivia. No offense to Olivia. But, like, I wanted to pull Violet more. Alright, so, uh, next time, uh, you guys, uh, see this, it's going to be nice and organized. Be right back. Alright, guys, and we are back. So, I uh, really like the pulls here. Let's, uh, let's start with, uh, start the, the Marvel Rares, yeah. So, Marvel Rare wise, we actually got one of each of the Marvel Rares. So, we got the Light, Darkness, uh, actually, wait. Yeah, no, no, sorry. But let me actually say this right. Light, fire, water, wind, and darkness. Uh, but the two that we got that were uh, actually full art were the light and darkness ones. That's cool. But it, it's cool uh, getting uh, one of each of the Marvel Warriors. 
If uh, I'm to base off what's in these packs from the previous pre-release kit, there should be a few more Marvel Rares in here, so that'll be fun for uh, for drafts. Uh, see, so yeah, super rare wise, we got so yeah, so five Marvel Rares, probably some more in the boosters. So yeah, super rares, we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen. 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24. Gotta recount that. 23, 24. Okay, yeah. The card like slipped for a second. So, yeah, 24 uh, super rares. Uh, we got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So, we got uh, 10 out of 24 of those were full arts. So, that's awesome. Uh, and, you know, we're, we're, we're close to some play sets of a lot of these, so that, that's that's pretty cool. So I, when, when I'm uh, cracking some uh, some boxes later, I'll hopefully be able to get some play sets of that. And through drafting and also boxes, I will hopefully be able to get play sets of those. Uh, so for rares, we have 1, 2, 3, 5, 6, 7, 4, 8, 4, 9, 50. We have uh, 50 rares. And then uh, out of the 50 rares, we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, and 15. 15 of those were full arts, so that's awesome. Then for our normal full arts, uh, a little hefty stack here. We got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 19, and 20. 20 full art normals. And then here's something that was pretty cool. I went ahead and like organized, well, so yeah, organized these. Um, so we had uh, one full art uh, special stone. These are normals in this set. Uh, I completely glossed over that when they were spoiled. But uh, so that's a play set. That's a play set. That's a play set. And that's a play set. That's, I, that's more than a play set, but and that's also slightly more than a play set. So if you uh, if you buy a pre-release kit or if you can find one and you're you know worried about stones at all, getting a pre-release kit will get you all of the stones basically because. I haven't even opened these, and if they're in the normal slot, you're, yeah, you're guaranteed a playset. I, I say guaranteed. You're more than likely gonna get a playset of the special stones for this set, so that's cool. Uh, and then, lastly, we have our rulers. We got uh, no duplicates, so that's good. Good to see that uh, if they're seeding the uh, pre-release kits at all, not having any of that action. Actually, wait, no, uh, I remember uh, someone was talking on the Ruler School Discord, I believe, and they got a duplicate. I think they had uh, Olivia as a duplicate or something, so rough times for them. Happy I didn't get a duplicate, but we got our boy Brad first, and then we got Wolfgang's uh, reincarnation. We got uh, another version of Faria, and then we have another new character, uh, Violet, so that's awesome. Uh, I still don't know who I'm gonna run come the uh, June GP, but uh, we'll see if the cards kind of speak for themselves, or uh, who knows, though. <laughs> oh, ah, man, almost forgot. So, booster-wise, so this is 12 right here, and this is 8. Yeah, that's 8. Um, I already, like, sorted and counted those. So we got 20 booster packs, which, uh... You know, compared to the last booster box ruler hunt I had, so much better even if you cut it in half, like 10 boosters is still better than the shit show that I had last time. <laughs> uh, so yeah, gonna, gonna look forward to uh, tossing these into the uh, the draft, uh, you know, uh, pool, whatever you want to call it. Uh, <laughs> I'm just rambling now. Alright, well... Hope you guys enjoyed this. Uh, look forward to uh, future booster box openings. You guys uh, have a good night, and uh, thanks for watching. See you in the next one.